In one of the most isolated places on Earth, where temperatures can reach minus 40 degrees, this young girl is trying to keep one of her people's oldest traditions alive. 14-year-old Akbota is learning how to hunt with a golden eagle. It's something that's been passed down through her family for generations. But it's not a skill that girls here are usually taught. In the history of Kazakhs, there has never been an eagle huntress. In the past, women didn't go up the mountains. They got married and moved away. Being an eagle huntress is a temporary thing. But that hasn't stopped Ekbota. For the past three years, her dad has been training her to become an eagle huntress. And it hasn't been easy. It took Akbota almost a year just to build up the strength needed to carry an eagle on her arm. Of course, girls can do anything the boys do. We're resilient. And how do you say, if you never give up, boy or girls, you can do anything? My daughter is very brave. She's determined to reach her goals. Girls can do martial arts, sambo, judo and wrestling. They're growing and learning and beating the boys. Akbota is Kazakh, a culture of people that live across parts of Eastern Europe and Central Asia. They've used eagles to hunt foxes, rabbits and wolves for thousands of years. Back then, they needed them for food and fur. But today, it's more about keeping this ancient tradition alive. Every winter, hunters leave their village for months at a time, trekking on horseback for days, looking for any sign of life. The eagles are blindfolded the entire time to keep them focused and calm. Then, when an animal is spotted, the blindfold is lifted and the hunt begins. Eagle hunters spend five years training before they are sent out on a hunt. And most of that training is learning how to bond with the bird, something Akbota is still mastering. Right now, she's working on her call. It's a key part of forming a strong bond between her and her eagle. But handling an eagle the same size as you can be a little tricky. Akbota still has two years to go before she will earn the title as Eagle Huntress. And after that, she hopes to be able to show the world this amazing part of their ancient culture. My plan for the future is to teach coming generations about raising and training eagles to hunt. I also want to introduce our eagle culture to the world. <laughs>